Hi all and welcome to another edition of the Linux Man Cave brought to you by the Linux Distro Community. Visit our website at www.linuxdistrocommunity.com Today I'm going to show you a video about uh, creating bigger menus for the visually impaired in XFCE4. Uh, when you get something like a, a distro like Voyager or even Zubuntu, the default menus come pretty tiny. Um, in fact, um, the font size for Voyager's default installation is actually 9. So I'm going to show you right now how to change that. So you go into the appearance, click here. Let's go ahead and boost it up to 12. That way you can actually see what the change is going to look like here, and when we click OK, it actually automatically applies that. One more thing that you may want to change is uh, the name in the window bar right above. And in order to do that, we come into the Window Manager, and right here the title font size we're going to set to 12 as well. That will increase the title font as well, so it makes it a little bit easier for you to see. Now in order to change the icons on the menu, you can see that the, the font here is already a little bit bigger, but we want to make these icons look a little bit easier to see as well. And in order to do that, we're going to go into our file manager. Now if you are unable to see any kind of hidden files, and hidden files are the ones that are associated with the dot before the name of the file, you need to go up to view and show hidden files and just put a check mark in there and you'll be able to see the hidden file folders and we're looking for the folder dot config and we are going to go into the dot config folder and then into xfce4 and then into xfconf, c-o-n-f. And one more folder, the xfce per channel xml folder. And in here we have a bunch of xml files, but the one that we are really looking for is xsettings.xml. Now you can right click on that and select open with and pick your favorite file text editor. I'm going to go ahead and use leafpad. Now once we're in this file, we're going to scroll down until we find the property tag called Icon Sizes. And you'll notice that the value for the Icon Sizes is blank. And I do have the correct one that we're going to be using down here, so I'm just going to highlight, copy, and then paste into the value settings right here. And that's going to give us some menu item changes, button changes, panel application menu changes, and panel directory menu changes. So once we've got those settings in there, all you have to do is uh, file and then save. And now we can exit out of this. Go ahead and close our file manager. And at this point, the update doesn't happen. So what you're going to have to do is log out and log back into your XFCE4 session and that will apply those changes for you. So let's go ahead and do that now. And the machine starts back up or the uh, X session starts up again. You can actually reboot too. Um, either way, it doesn't matter. And once you click on it, you'll notice that we now have a much easier to view icons. Uh, if your menus are bigger with all these new icons than the screen allows, it will automatically scroll those for you. So you will have that ability as well. well I hope this helps you out. And uh, if you need more information on this or any other project that we've done, or if you have a project suggestion for me to do, please comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching this video. Brought to you by the Linux Distro Community at www.linuxdistrocommunity.com. And this is so long for now from the Man Cave. Have a good one.